Okay, guys. And next, change your attitude. If you are experiencing a negative attitude about work, a relationship, or life in general, recognize that attitude can be changed. And attitude change can take place based on new knowledge, new experience, or a desire to change. You can think in positive way, you relax. But only one person can make that change, and that person is you, yourself only. Changing, a uh, changing negative attitudes into positive attitudes can be very satisfying because positive attitudes are a foundation for personal satisfaction and effective human relations. When you change your attitude, you automatically change your perspective, the way you interpret things, the decisions you make, the actions you take, the results you get. Step to improve your attitude. Developing positive attitudes and eliminating negative ones is the best. First step toward self-improvement, but where should you start? There is no one way for improving attitudes that will work for everyone. So, the following suggestions can be helpful if you have the try and inner strength to try to change. First, visualize the attitudes you want to improve. Um, picture the attitudes you want to change. Write a description box of the image you have to yourself that you will embody after you have achieved your attitude improvement goals. Uh, for example, you may see yourself as having more potential in the classroom. Your mental pictures must be so clear and present that it can create a pattern for your behavior. Again, attitude to drive behavior. And next, resolve to adopt those attitudes you want to improve. After you identify the attitudes you want to improve, make a, a conscious effort to change them. The change attitude are a reflection of your idea. Your goal is to cultivate those improved qualities because they are needed as a model for your cell renewal. Next, use the image of your ideal self as a model for your behavior. With practice and effort, the, uh, the desirable behavior will come naturally and the improved attitude will transform you. For example, your goal may be to change your please don't call on me. Attitude when asked to participate in a class description, you could practice imagining yourself answering clearly and confidence when called upon with time you may be can do you can discuss in the class and next. Choose to create a positive atmosphere around you. 
Every day you have choice to make, and the choice to have a positive attitude or negative attitude is one of those very choice. You can create a positive atmosphere by smiling to everyone, being present, and making a good thing make you to be interested. In what going on around you, look for positive, good nature, or complimentary things to say, as you look for favorable qualities in others. You will improve your attitude and create a positive environment around you. And I think everything start with your mind. Your opinion. Try to think a good thing. Try to like the people around you. You can even turn a negative into a positive. You are your coworker. And next, surround yourself with positive people. It has been said that you become the average sum of the five people with. Whom you associate more frequently, as you think about these people, ask yourself five questions: Who am I around? What are they doing to me? What have they got me saying? Where do they have me going? What do they have me thinking? What do they have me becoming? Then you ask yourself: Is that okay? Is that okay, right? If that okay, okay, you can go ahead. If it's bad. How to stop this problem? And next, celebrate your successes. You need to celebrate your successes and not not blame yourself when you have failures. Learn from setbacks, but then move forward with optimism for the future. Okay, and next, attitudes are contagious. Have you ever wondered why people have the attitudes they have? More important, have you questioned where your attitude come from? Is your attitude wrong? Catching. One people's attitude has a powerful influence on the attitudes of others. This is especially evident when people are involved in a team effort, in the workplace, on the playing field, or working as a group in the classroom. You have probably witnessed a situation where one individual causes. A positive change in the attitudes of a group. One people with a negative attitudes can bring everyone down. You can think about yourself. If you happy in the morning, and when you meet meet your friends, and your friend have negative, of course, it make you down. Okay, guys. And the next one. Okay. Productive versus non-productive attitudes.
This list productive and unproductive attitudes that you should recognize when confronted with a difficult situation. Ask yourself, what do I want or need right now? Which attitude will serve me best? The sooner you know what you want and the best attitude to help you get it, the sooner your body language, words, and vocabulary will adjust to help achieve the desired outcome. Your attitudes influence others. Okay, attitudes are catching when a group attitude changes. It is because one or more individuals take the initiative to spark the change when the leader or member of a group lets his or her positive attitude show the effect of the group can be electric. This can be observed when the positive energy of a team members or coach of the team uh, ignites a winning spirit in the team. Everyone seems to respond and performance improve. This principle was in place when after being lost in the bristars. Uh, one mountain climbers literally step the leaf of other climbers because his positive attitude inspired the others to make the effort required for survival. The principle also apply in the workplace. A positive team spirit and high moral contribute to effective job performance. Okay. Negative attitudes are unproductive. Okay. Be aware of the influence you have on others. One individual can spark a change in an entire group. We are inspired to follow and emulate our chosen low models. A positive attitude and high moral contribute to effective job performance. Attitudes of others affect you. Not only do you need to deal with your own attitudes, you will frequently need to cope with the attitudes of others as well. Consumer researchers discovered that while we may not like to admit it, with other people think about something could affect what we think about it. The findings reported in the Journal of Consumer Research confirm that social networks greatly influence an individual's behavior. Negative Opinions cause the greatest attitude shifts, not just from good to bad, but also from bad to worse. Um, you may recall a time when the attitudes of those around you were negative, and as a result, you feel yourself becoming negative too. By being aware of the influence others have on you, you can resist and avoid negative influences on your attitudes. Okay, so ignore what you see and hear that is negative. Walk away from negative situations. Be aware of the influence others have on you. Control your negative reactions and feeling toward others. Please concerned about this. Okay.
Okay, guys. So we finished for these chapters, and we will talk about your attitude and your image for next week. Okay.